Hey everyone, it's Chris from Flaghouse and I'm here today with Chip Candy. For today's activity, we're gonna be looking at more games and activities that you can use using multi buckets. From throwing and catching to using it for fielding, these multi buckets actually started out as popcorn buckets. A family in my school had a movie theater, went out of business, and they gave us all the popcorn buckets, and now we have multi buckets for throwing and catching. So there's all kinds of great activities that we can do with the multi buckets. You're gonna see them coming up next on the Flag House Activity Channel. These are multi buckets. They actually started out as popcorn buckets. And what we're going to do today is I'm going to give you a tennis ball and I'm going to have you try to figure out different ways that we can catch. And I'm going to show you some and I'm going to give you a bunch of challenges and you're going to see how many different things you can do. So I'd like you to pick and choose whichever bucket you would like, take whatever color you would like, and then also you're going to take one tennis ball. So if you are right handed, put the ball in your right hand. If you're left handed, put the ball in your left hand and hold the bucket in your other hand. So I'm just going to give you some easy ones to start and we'll get harder and harder. Just bounce it and catch it with the bucket. Bounce and catch. So you can bounce and spin and catch it. Bounce, spin, catch it. Bounce, spin, catch it. Nice, nice. Can you catch it on the back of your bucket like that. There's a catch. There's one. Oh, almost. There's one. I got a good catch there. All right, almost. How about bouncing it on there? So I'm going to take it and I'm just going to bounce it up on the bucket. Well done, well done. All right, let's try this one. Can you bounce the ball on the ground and then catch it while it's on your head? So I'm going to try to catch it while it's on my head. Oh, that was it. Nice. Nice. He got it. That was it. All right, here's your next one. I call this, we call this one the prediction bounce. So I'm going to bounce it first, and then I'm going to put my bucket right underneath it. Now, it may bounce out. That's OK. But you want to try to get your bucket right underneath it. So bounce it, and then put your bucket right underneath it. Oh, close. Oh, that was perfect. Here's the ultimate challenge. All right, everybody ready? Come on back in here. Let me give you the ultimate challenge. So I'm going to bounce it. I'm going to put the bucket down. It has to hit, and then I've got to catch it off of the bucket. All right, so I'm going to bounce it, bucket, and then catch. Almost, almost. Bounce, bucket, catch. There it is. We got one. We had one there. Bounce, bucket, no, hit the rim, close. Bounce, bucket. Let's do one last thing. If you're good, you can put the bucket here, stick it on your head, and walk around with it on your head. Every once in a while, you have to feel up there to make sure it's still up there. See if you can walk around with it up there. That's just one of the ways that you can use multi-buckets. So kind of fun to have multi-buckets. Take a tennis ball, you can invent all kinds of ways to throw and catch. Nice job today. All right, let's put them all back here. We'll put the balls back in the blue bucket. Well done. Thank you so much for checking out our videos. Please like, share, or drop us a comment, and you definitely want to subscribe to our channel. We always have a new episode every Wednesday morning. Click these links for more videos or access to the Flaghouse Activity Guide page. See you next time.